Hello, hello everyone. It's Carl Eric here with another awesome tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to add the effect of you shooting a wall with a gun. So first you'll need to get uh, a footage of you just entering the scene and faking a few shots on the wall. And then you'll need uh, well the video which I got here and then you'll need a gunshot sound effect. You can find, find that on the Google just type uh, gunshot sound effect and you'll find some then uh, some kind of bullet hole and uh, this one it's just a picture I've got it I got it from uh, Google again I just type gunshot and you go into images and you'll have a, a bunch of them I chose this one first you need to go through your video and check about where are you your first your first shot is here's my first one like this and uh, you can uh, copy it with control C after clicking on the the shot and just bring it to the next place you're shooting right here and again here like that okay so here we have three shots computer is very slow right now so it's not exactly perfect then make a another uh, video track just right click we insert video track on the top one take your image drag it on top right where the sound starts and make it bigger by pressing on the, the end and dragging it to the end like this so it keeps a one thing all the way now you have it like that so what you're gonna do is right here press on the event and crump crop I mean and you click on that and uh, you're down here you're gonna press on mask and select the tool under the small arrow and what you're gonna do is just make a mask around the whole bullet so you don't have the dark around it I'm just gonna do this one fast Here we go, and it should make become yellow when you, you've done a complete surrounding. Okay, then if you look through it, you'll see it's just a bullet hole. To make it smaller, you go down here, press on track motion, and what you're gonna do is make it smaller by pressing on the corner and drag it the size you need it to be like that and um, press the middle and just drag it where your shot looks like it's being shot at here it looks good okay then just copy that and insert another track and place the other picture where the second gunshot is like that and do the same thing here but make it smaller so it's still at the end of the video like that and same thing when track motion again make it small not the same size as the other one so it's like different right and press the middle bring it where it looks like you're shooting again that sounds good and then once more at the third gunshot right here insert a new track, track motion again and right here copy third picture make it smaller 
go in track motion like that click on the image so you, you can see what it looks like make it the size you need and the right here sounds good all right then there's still one more step there is one thing another thing I have and it is a f muzzle flash which I got on a website which is posted in the um, on the side here it is so again you go on top insert a new video track and go where the first picture is or gunshot and you just bring the muzzle flash here okay and then press on the pan crop and what you do do a mask again around the bullet you find your when the flash is out and you do a mask around it like this complete it now the only thing you, all you'll see is this if you check it you'll have like this big flash on the side so what you need to do is go in track motion again and uh, you'll rotate it on the angle of the gun Make it the size looks right. Put it in front of the gun like that, and you can make it smaller to see how long you want it. Okay, so that's one. You can copy that one to make it easier insert a new video track where the second check where the second picture is alright that was fine paste the other one go in track motion once more place it where it needs to be in front make it smaller this all right that sounds fine and again insert track find your third gunshot and control V and for last time track motion check arrange it like this bring it in front so that should look pretty good and to make it a bit more realistic find your, your gun sound effect and on the top where it says gain is and the number just click on the top and drag the small bar down and again on the other side but don't make it the same so make it different so it, you know it makes sounds are different so it's not like if every time was the same gunshot and here you have it mine was uh, not too good I made it pretty fast but uh, take more time into it and uh, yours will look pretty good if you work on it and so here you have it the gunshot effect so uh, thanks for watching and uh, please uh, comment and subscribe